produce section and look at all this colorful, beautiful produce. We're gonna pick up what we need for our salad. We need one onion, nice firm onion, and we need some of this beautiful celery. We're in the bulk section now, and I'm getting some of our organic short grain brown rice. When you come shopping, you might be a little confused because they're short grain and long grain. I prefer the short grain. It has a sweeter taste. We're picking up the condiments that we need for the dressing. We need some tamari, and let's not forget our delicious corn oil. And our last ingredient, some organic corn. And let's head back to the kitchen and get cooking. Welcome back. Next, we're going to make a healthy brown rice and sunflower seed salad. First off, we need to take our sunflower seeds and toast them. Sunflower seeds are your high vitality food. They give you lots of energy and vitality. And we are going to just simply toast them. And the way you do that is you pour it into the bowl and you just get the sunflower seeds wet like so. That ensures that the sunflower seeds will cook evenly and you won't end up scorching any. Take a dry fry pan and just put the sunflower seeds in the pan like so. And then you just lightly toast them on the stove back there until they're a, a beautiful golden brown color. All nuts and seeds contain a particular enzyme that makes them very hard to digest. And just by toasting the seeds, it makes it more digestible and your body can assimilate them more easily. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna dice this celery up here. I'm gonna get the cutting board a little bit wet. This is a really good cutting technique when you're at home cutting your vegetables. If you use your wooden cutting board and you get it wet before you actually start cutting your vegetables, what happens is the water fills in the pores of the wood so the wood doesn't absorb the color and the odor of the vegetable that you're cutting. And that way your cutting board stays fresher so much longer and it also doesn't end up smelling like onions or anything like that. Now what I'm going to do with the celery is I'm going to lightly steam it. And the reason why I'm going to lightly steam it is to just freshen it up and make it that bright green color that's just so beautiful. Now every once in a while with the sunflower seeds, you just want to give it just a quick stir, okay? Just to make sure that all the sunflower seeds cook evenly. And then the next vegetable we're going to put in the salad is an onion. So what I did was I soaked the onion in some cold water. And you know what that does? That prevents you from crying when you cut the onion. And then what I'm going to do, I'm just going to dice the onion. And so I go straight up and down like so. So I'm going to just lightly steam the onion. And that's going to take some of that pungency out of the onion. And it's actually going to create the onion being nice and sweet for us. I'm going to check the sunflower seeds. And then see, it didn't take hardly any time at all. And the celery is already beautiful, bright green. So we will put that in the bowl. And next we're going to steam the onions. And the dressing for the salad, we're gonna put in a little pot and we're gonna warm it on the stove. And the reason behind that is when you warm the dressing, it just combines the ingredients and just makes it much more flavorful. The ingredients of our dressing is water, some of our tamari, and then I have a little bit of corn oil. I love using corn oil because it gives that delicious, rich, uh, rich flavor without having to put butter in there, which gives you the saturated fat. The corn oil is a good quality fat, and that's what I like using the corn oil for. And I'm just going to heat it back here on the stove. Well, our sunflower seeds are done now. The sunflower seeds, they're just nicely brown. Oh, I wish you could smell this. Oh my gosh, this smells so good. So in the bowl, I'll put this, the toasted sunflower seeds. The onions are done being steamed now, and we'll put the onions in the bowl. The main ingredient of the salad is our brown rice. You just take one cup of brown rice, you mix it with two cups of water, 
and then you bring it to a boil. You let it open boil for just a minute and then you reduce it to the lowest possible temperature you have on your stove, put the lid on it and it pot boils for one hour. The brown rice absorbs all that water and it comes out perfect for you every time. Once it's cooked, brown rice has this delicious sweet flavor. It's going to make our salad just taste awesome. Brown rice is very high in B vitamins, it's high in fiber, and it's also our complex carbohydrate. Complex carbohydrates are what gives your body energy. It gives your, your body long, sustainable energy to last throughout the day. So we will put the brown rice in the bowl along with all of our other vegetables and sunflower seeds. And the last ingredient that's gonna go into our salad is corn. Yum. Corn is actually the signature grain for the summertime. So whenever you put corn into a recipe, it gives this lightness and this vitality to the dish and it makes it so delicious. It has that sweet flavor to it also. And you pour the dressing over the top. And then you just mix it all together. And that is our brown rice and sunflower seed salad. We'll finish up now by taking our delicious tempeh burger. We're gonna serve it on one of these wonderful whole grain buns. And we're gonna put some colorful leaf lettuce on there. And you can serve it with your favorite condiment, some mayonnaise, mustard, or ketchup, whatever you prefer. And we'll serve up our colorful brown rice and sunflower seed salad. And remember, you'll be serving these healthy dishes at your next picnic. Both of these recipes are featured in my cookbook. See you next time on Healthy Cooking with Macro Val. Thanks for joining us on Vegetarianism, the Noble Way of Living. Please stay tuned to Supreme Master Television for Between Master and Disciples. May your blessed heart always remain youthful in happiness. For more details, please visit www.suprememastertv.com forward slash VEG.